Well, hello again. Last Sunday I was up at a church in South Farnborough, North Camp, uh, where I was pastor for 20 years. Um, and I haven't preached there for 35 years. And so I had to be very careful last Sunday not to slip into a lot of nostalgia. Because during those 20 years, a lot of good things happened and I could have talked about it all the morning, but I disciplined myself uh, and I didn't do too badly. And of course, it's no good always being looking back. We've got to look forward. And as it happens, they've got a new pastor coming in September. And so I want him to see even bigger things and greater things than I saw in my 20 years uh, in, uh, in that church. Uh, we can be nostalgic about our football club, can't we? My goodness me! I mean, here we go! 18,509 people were present here on the 9th of September 1979 for the League Cup second round against Manchester United and I was here up in the East Bank with all those people. How did we all get in? Well, those were the days. And who did I see play? Well, Jimmy, I could go through the team here, but I must mention Nobby Snut Styles, Bobby Charlton, Brian Kidd, Georgie Brest. Well, did we have a night? We lost 3-1, but Never mind, a bit of nostalgia, a bit of a story, and then another one. Well, a night to remember. I've got a mug to prepare me to say that on Wednesday the 24th of August 2011 at Upton Park, we went to play West Ham. And we won 2-1. And I was in the coach that went from here up there with a friend of mine who was a great West Ham supporter, but he took it quite well. Uh, so you see, we can be nostalgic about our football club. And it's no good looking back though. We got to look forward and we are almost into a new season. So we've got to get behind the manager and the, his staff and the players and well, get behind everyone and be positive about this season. Uh, some people tell me, ooh, it's going to be a hard season for teams like Aldershot. Well, cheer up a bit. It might not be as bad as they think. And if we all get behind the team, then I'm quite sure we're going to have some great times this season. Right, I better do what I've come here to do, didn't I? I mean, um, there's so much to say, but uh, I hope you're interested. If you're not, well, too bad you'll be interested in this, because now we've got the five-pound winner for today, and it is number 16. Number 16 is the winner of the five pound draw. Richard Dowding. Richard Dowding, right, okay, well done Richard. Oh my word, what are you gonna have coming your way? You'll get about 225 pounds, Richard. Sound pretty good, doesn't it? Well done, good, now let's go for the Two, two pound draw. Oh, uh, where, where are we? I don't want to do anything silly. Oh, there we go. Because I am a bit silly sometimes. But when you get to my age, it really doesn't matter. I think you don't have to worry too much. And I certainly don't worry. You realise that, don't you? Okay, here we go. Here's the winner of the two pound. And the winner is number 68. Number 68. Richard Day. Richard Day, right. Richard, two Richards today then. And Richard, you're going to receive 194 pounds. And I'm glad to say that we're lifting up a little more from what we gave last week to the club. 
This week it's £419. And so let's keep going in that direction and uh, let's look up and be cheerful and expect the best. The best is yet to come. Don't be too nostalgic, but enjoy it while it's there and look forward to greater things. Goodbye. God bless you.